Jen Wazla Krem says Strawberry Shortcake's new red velvet brownie is to die for! She likes me! She really likes me! I'd like to thank Custard, my very besties, and of course, my lucky spoon, which has always been there through thick and thin batter. <laughs> Another glowing review. If you're not careful, those very besties of yours may start to get jealous. That would never happen. That's what I thought, too. Back when I had my squad of baking buds, now it's me by myself, all alone. Hey, Uncle P, I need. Not you. now! <clears throat> <gasps> Is that the lucky spoon I've heard so much about? I'd keep an eye on that. You never know who will betray you. So, I'm like a thousand percent sure the pie man's gonna try to steal my spoon. Ugh, could he be any more obvious? Okay, pie man, give me back my... Huh? Hey, neighbor! Just taking in the news of the day. Hmm. Aha! Blueberry? What are you doing with my spoon? Oh, I didn't see it there. Maybe it was lonely and came to see my ice cream scoop. <gasps> Maybe they're in love. Aw, oh, look, they're spooning. Okay. <laughs> Bye, Blueberry. Bye. Hi, man. Yeah. Oh, oh, hold on a sec. What's up? Huh. I'm sure I know the answer to this, but did either of you take my spoon? Why would we take your spoon when we have the Mega Stirrer? It's still just a prototype. Man, but he's up there. The spoon's down here. My friends are down here, but they don't want the spoon. He wants the spoon. He warned me they would want the spoon, but the pie man wants the spoon. And also, who cuts their toenails in the middle of the courtyard? Nope. <laughs> no problems here. Just hanging out, staring at my spoon. I have no idea what you mean. I've never seen this crow in my life. <laughs> Ugh. You pets deserve a special treat. Follow me. You had one simple job, bird brain, but no. The only thing that's purple and reliable around here is me. He blames everybody else for everything. Having pets is the very best. Cracker? <laughs> Is it finished yet? <laughs> finished? <laughs> Is it finished? Awesome! The only berry more into Lemon's inventions than Lemon is orange. How about a jetpack? I have an alternative. Hey, Plum. What's up? I traversed here to inform you that the Big Apple City Science Museum is holding an inventing competition in the park today. And I deduced that Lemon might be a perfect candidate. Eh, competitions aren't my thing. But they are my thing, and inventing is your thing. This could be a perfect our thing together. Please, it could be so awesome. Uh... I guess. We're in. I'm as giddy as a gigawatt to see what gizmo you devise. We're gonna win this thing. Yay. I wonder who your competition is. Oh, lime tart and lemon tort. Lime, lime, lemon, lemon. 
lemon. I'd say may the best berry win, but that would give us the advantage. Lemon is the best inventor I know. Ha! You must not know many inventors. <laughs> Come on, Lemon. Welcome one, welcome all. Each team has been tasked with inventing something to help every baker be their very best. Bakers, yeah. are you ready? <sighs> well, then you may begin. Competing. Maybe that's not Lemon's thing. Sometimes I forget. Not every berry loves competition quite as much as I do. You're not having fun, are you? Inventing is fun. You pressure me to win? Not so much. I got carried away. I'm sorry. I love winning, but I love having fun with my awesome inventor friend even more. If you want to have fun, I have an idea. I give you the big old medic! Oh, ooh, the leftomly fluffy. Next up, lemon meringue and orange blossom. A jetpack! A jetpack? Well, what does that have to do with baking? Your robot serves one cupcake at a time, but with this jetpack, you can share your baked goods with every berry. How very helpful for a culinary connoisseur like me. Woo! On behalf of the Science Museum, I declare Lemon Meringue and Orange Blossom as our winners. Woo! Now this is awesome! Whoa! Coachella is Big Apple City's biggest music festival. So, Blueberry offered to be my food truck placement guru to help me find the perfect spot to set up the extraordinary berry. Here your journey begins. This is the light in the darkness. The what? <gasps> oh, smell that? Smellspiration has hit, and I must follow my nose. Have fun. The light in the darkness. Darkness. If that's not a sign, I don't know what is. This is the perfect spot. Turbo boost. <laughs> lime tart and lemon tart, right? I'm strawberry shortcake. We know a lot of the same berries. So uh, you probably didn't see me there. All good. It's all good. But I was actually parked here first, so. The Poachella permit that I'm sure you also have says anyone can park anywhere at any time. Anytime is now. Anywhere is here. <laughs> Maybe there's another anywhere that's not totally blocking berries from seeing my truck? This longitude and latitude gives us the exact location for optimal performance. And this spot is big enough that I can hit the turbo turbo boost! I said one turbo boost only. Seriously, give me that thing. <laughs> Your setback, but there's got to be somewhere else with even more light, right? Here my journey begins. It's the light and darkness. Uh, what's that for? You're parked on a sinkhole. Oh, it doesn't look like me. Uh -uh. <laughs> okay, light. Show me what you. What? what? Okay, no. Ooh, stinky! Hello, 
holes, no falling trees, no creepy birds. This has to be it! Oh, come on! We needed a bigger spot for the Turbo Turbo Boost. The Pochella permit states. I know what it states! Oh, the festival's about to open. Now I'll never get any customers. Light in the darkness. I was all over the light! And I still ended up in darkness and totally blocked from the... Whoa, I'm in serious need of a snack and shade. Whoa, you open? <gasps> Find the light is finding the silver lining in any situation! Hey, every berry! Need a break from the heat? Come get a Pochella pastry and enjoy some cool shade. Clever berry. What? Were you up there this whole time? Yep. I've been boiling cabbage. Mm. <laughs> That's what that smell was? <laughs> I know, right? Total yum. It's my newest ice cream creation. Boiled cabbage and marshmallow cone. Mm. Oh, can you eat that somewhere else? The Potella permit states you can eat anything, anywhere. Anything is a boiled cabbage marshmallow cone, and, well, you know the rest. Ooh, it's an acquired taste. Ooh, very nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, we, we love, love chocolate, chocolate croissants. Fred and Lime started a weekly fashion brunch to bond over their mutual love of all things fashion. They're so in sync, they even say the same things. It's adorable. So, so trendy. trendy. So chic. Love. love. And a little creepy. Last look. Vanity Pear has your dad's waistcoat on the cover. <laughs> <gasps> She's wearing Dad's waistcoat, too! But it's shorter, sleeveless! She changed it? We must meet this vision of style! Hi, I'm Slime, this is Bread. Crepe. Crepe Suzette. Enchanté. Is that a fluffy chiffon waistcoat? Oui, I love the pattern, but the cut it did not work for me, so I made some adjustments. I am an aspiring fashion designer. <gasps> Brett and I love fashion, too. We actually have a fashion brunch. You you could join us if you wanted. Fashion and brunch? Oh, very much, we. Oui. Great, but not now. It's later, uh, late brunch, in like an hour? So, lunch. <laughs> yep. Gives me time to take photos for inspiration. See you in an hour. Our brunch is right now. Why? You saw her? We're not trendy enough. We need a better setup, cooler outfits, fancier food. No chocolate croissants. We need avant-garde. I don't know what that means. Look it up. Come on, Lime. We don't have much time. Avant-garde. Oh. We need looks that say cutting edge. Hello? Gorgeous. Brunch in the courtyard is more open. But this is exclusive. A VIP vibe. Hm. Do you think Lemon would be our bouncer? She can be pretty scary. Did somebody say avant-garde? Ah! Ah! Horrifying. It's perfect. Hmm. Uh, you don't look very excited. I liked our fashion brunch the way it was. But Brad really wants to impress Crepe. You know what I think you should do to impress Crepe? What? Nothing. You're pretty impressive just the way you are. Fred, about this brunch. Hello? Crepe! Welcome to our fashion brunch. It's au courant. It's on mode. It's... Uh, not what I was expecting. I, uh... Do you not like it? What matters is, do you like it? Brett and I are always trying new ideas, but I think we both agree this isn't really our vibe. Oh, good. You have no idea how often berries try to impress me by pretending to be avant-garde. Oh, you don't say. What kind of berry would do that? <laughs> Shall we go outside for brunch? <laughs> I was afraid you wanted to eat in here. <laughs> I brought chocolate croissants. We love chocolate croissants. Ooh, very nice. Aw, still adorable. Oh, sacre bleu. That, that look.
book is tragic! And still a little creepy. Ugh, work at City Hall was brutal! I am as beat as the mayor in today's polls. Huh, the fairy works was slammed. I'm as fried as the fritters I sold out of. Good, Good night! night. <sighs> A cricket? Okay, just ignore it. <gasps> Is that... A cricket? Yep. Huh. How did it get past my ultrasonic bug repellent force field? You know, I paid a lot of money to install that thing. Nothing should survive in here. <laughs> Except us. Wow, I did not know Aunt Praline disliked bugs so much. I mean, it's why I left Berryville. Where is it? Where could the little guy be? Shh, 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 shh. Listen. Living room? Acata Domesticus, the house cricket. <laughs> Just the TV. Exodus. Sorry, David Attenberry. <gasps> Where is the beast? Beast? A uh, little cricket? <gasps> Where is it? Where are you? <laughs> Feels like Aunt Praline is getting a little carried away. <gasps> The air ducts! Come on! Not a little, a lot, a whole lot carried away! And really, um, Sir Chirps a lot is annoying. <laughs> totally. But I just. Oh! It's taunting us. We're gonna beat it. Don't you worry about a thing, Strawberry. Don't you worry. Yeah, I'm not worried about the cricket. <laughs> ah! It lured us in and did that on purpose! It's... it's the cricket or us! We only have one option left. Atomic Pesto Obliterator! Set timer. Get to minimum safe distance. Obliterates on contact! Do not inhale. Maybe lethal... Oh! Fresh tropical breeze scent! I just want the cricket out of here! This is a little extreme. It's left us no choice! Ah! <laughs> We wait. I can't let Sir Chirps a lot be obliterated. I have to save him. No! Strawberry, my only niece! No! No! Oh, how's your night going? Oh, you guys are so cute. Obliteration in 30 seconds. Not today, obliterator! Five, four, three, two, one. Close. Oh, there you are. You owe me, Sir Chirps a lot. Now you go on, young one. Be free and chirp somewhere far, far away. Bye. <gasps> Where is it? Big bad bug is gone. It's gone now. No bug's gonna hurt you now, Auntie Praline. Okay, maybe things got a little crazy there for a minute, but hey, we made it through, and we can finally get some rest. Sleep tight, Strawberry. Good night, Aunt Praline. <laughs> Since when does Big Apple City have a rooster? <laughs> ah, the sweet sounds of the fairy works. <gasps> this place better be spotless when I get back. <laughs> Not all the sounds are sweet. Huh? Never too emotional. Never done and no one to have fun with. Cause I'm not that social. You hear it too, right? Strawberry sees what I deal with. Wishing I was breaking free. What is it? A classically trained ghost? And no berry knows what I Inside of me. Sour grapes? You were singing. Mm, not me. Might have been the cat. I had no idea you were so unhappy. You've met my uncle, Pie Man. Right. Yeah, good point. But if you're unhappy, why not quit? Raspberry tart and bread pudding are friends with you now. 
Nobody has time for me except Uncle Pie Man. Oh, why are you making that face? I had no idea Sour felt this way. But now that I know, I can make sure every berry is friends with her. Could there be a more perfect job for me? <laughs> sour, sour, sour. Stop it! You're hilarious! Did you all know how funny Sour Grapes is? <laughs> sour, tell them what you were just... Oh, where did she go? It's fine, it's fine. You're all going to love hanging out with Sour. Even though she sang that sad song about <gasps> her song. That's it. Once every berry hears you sing, they'll know how you feel. Ready to wow the crowd, Sour? No. Mm, let me handle this one. I get it. Strawberry can be a lot. But it's because she cares. A lot. And when she's a little too much, you can tell her. She listens. Eventually. Hmm. I don't like being the focus of anything. I just want to be myself around berries I like. Good, because Brett and I have missed you. We thought you wanted to be with Purple Pie Man. Well, he is family. Yeah, but friends are the family you get to choose yourself. What are you doing down there? <gasps> is the shop spotless yet? Nope. Nope? What do you mean, nope? I quit. Where are you gonna go? With them? I'm the only one who gets you. We may not get sour. I may not get sour. But that's okay, because we accept her just the way she is. Fine. I don't need you. I always land on my... <laughs> Ow. Sour Grapes, you are the best group hug time, am I right? You're at an 11, and I'm gonna need you at, like, a 1.5. Got it. No hugs. Ah, oh, good. See? She listens. Eventually. Once upon a time, a naive country berry moved to the big city. The famous purple pie man said she could be his partner. She just gave him her truck. The extraordinary berry. She did. And he fired her at the end. No happily ever after for this berry. Strawberry, what are you doing? Packing. Big Apple City chewed me up and spit me out. So I'm heading back to Berryville where I belong. You think maybe you're being, I don't know, a little overdramatic? No. Okay, you want to give up and go back home? I won't stop you, but first, come with me. And Praline, why are we here? Shortcakes, we heard you were thinking of leaving. This is why that's a really bad idea with interpretive dance from Blueberry. Huh? The Berry Works has never smelled so good. You really do make the world a better place. And you've got us, your very besties. Big Apple City needs strawberry shortcake. This is sweet, but without a trial. Let me stop you. The Berry Works is trendy. It's chic. And it's my job to keep it that way. You belong here. Sure, this is small, but with four wheels and an oven, it is Berry Works approved! Hey, Strawberry, it's Lemon. I don't want you to go. That oven sounds just like you. Yeah, <laughs> I put microphones in everything. I insist this berry be removed from the premises! Her contract is clear. Ex-employees are to be nowhere near any purple pie shop. That's my truck. No, it's my truck. The purple pie on the fly. Trademark pending. Your Berry Works contract states that vendor disputes are settled by management. With no truck, she's not a vendor. Ugh, fine. I ruined her once, I can ruin her again. <laughs> All right, that's it. 
Why are you so obsessed with ruining my life? Uh, because to stay famous, I need to crush your spirit before you become competition. So it's because I'm a good baker? Uh, duh. How do you think I got where I am today? I can make my pies as bland as I want. Those big apple blockheads will eat anything as long as I make sure they have no better actions. I love my customers. You don't love anything. I used to look up to you. Now I just feel bad for you. Ugh. Are you okay, Shortcakes? I'm great. I just wish every berry could hear what the pie man said about them. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. What? I said I put microphones in everything. I can make my pies as bland as I want. Those big <laughs> apple blockheads, big, 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 big apple blockheads, make sure they sure. sure. have no better actions. Big apple blockheads, huh? <laughs> what? No. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, his vibe isn't really on brand for the Berry Works. We're terminating his contract. Oh, and look, it says right here in subsection D, once terminated, anything left behind is Berry Works property. Eddie Berry need a food truck? Ah, so now that you're staying, what are you gonna do next? I have no idea. But with friends like these, it's gonna be awesome. Oh, no stress, no pressure. Just have to, uh, you know, get absolutely everything done. There's still so much left to do. Baking, last minute shopping, decorating the clubhouse for our winter swirl party. Picking out the perfect winter swirl tree for my family. Finding a dress for the holiday party. Building bread pudding a snow machine that turns the berry works into a winter wonderland. There's just not enough time. What time does blooming berries close? I gotta get a belt. An engine belt for the snow machine. <laughs> you berries need to relax and enjoy the holidays. We'll enjoy the holidays if we can get everything done in time. There's always enough time. That's what makes winter swirl so magical. Every winter swirl, Cinnamon Swirl flies her cinnamon sleigh around the world. If she can do that in one night, then we can get everything done too. Yeah, but Cinnamon Swirl has magic. And an army of berrykins baking all our treats. I'm not sure there's any magic that can help us get everything done. Oh, I think there is. There's magic in the air. A special magic swirling everywhere. We'll be okay this holiday. Even though it's true that we have so much to do, the real magic here is doing it all with you.
can't believe we got all that done. Pretty magical. Really just good time management. <laughs> I bet even Cinnamon Swirl would be impressed. Wow. I have a feeling she is. <laughs> Winter Swirl is the most magical time of year. to be a pet and not have a care in the world. But hey, being a busy berry is a good thing. Every berry is loving Granberry Jam's famous triple berry jelly donut recipe. Mwah! Thanks, Granberry Jam. Without your special card, I'd be lost. Aha! Uh -huh. Without that recipe card, Shortberry Snot Cake would be lost. I need to steal it. Or since you're a baker, you could... I don't know, go with me here, bake something? Once I send snot cake into a self-doubt spiral, I'll bake something better than she could dream of! Sour goops, has my protege helped me steal that card? Strawberry doesn't deserve that. Oh, even after she didn't come to your surprise party yesterday? What surprise party? When Noberry showed up, I didn't tell you about it, because I care. So? Oh, fine. Whatever. Ah! Emergency! Ah! Emergency! Ah! 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 Trouble! Welcome to the Extraordinary Berry. Uh, can I help you? Jelly in a donut. Wowza, how did you come up with that? My Granberry Jam, actually. How interesting. Tell me more. Ow. I'm sorry, allergic to donuts. <laughs> this is it. I'm a genius. <laughs> Strawberry shortcake. Oh, uh, you won the Berry Work sweepstakes. Go out front to claim your prize. I don't even remember entering a sweepstakes. <laughs> I'm done for today. I knew I didn't sign up for a sweepstakes. Wow. Must have had the wrong berry. Great mustache, though. Oh, thank you, Custard. Most important ingredient is confidence. Love always, Granberry Jam. See? I'd be lost without her special card. Wow. Oh, you've been laying around all day. What are you so exhausted about? The Mint Gala. The fashion event of the season. This year's theme is confection, and my dad designed a dress for Banafi. Banafi? Lime's dad designing Banafi's fresh mint gala dress is huge. I can't wait to see what he's come up with. <gasps> Correct response. Like cotton candy clouds floating in a blue sky, Banafi will slide that runway. As soon as she gets here. I'm sure Banafi's going to love it, Dad. Of course she will. I made it. Your fluffy chiffon. Every year he refuses to dress me. And every year his design rules the runway. Oh, but not this year. This year I will rule the pink carpet. 
Have you seen what you're wearing? It's jelly bean realness! Doesn't matter. Like Grandpa Pie Crust always said, if you can't win fair and square, cheat! My Fluffy, this gown is quite the look. As always, I can't wait to see it on Bella. Oh, <gasps> my dress! Oh, oh how clumsy of sour grapes this... to bump into me! I <clears throat> such a shame. You would almost think this was on purpose if it wasn't so obviously an accident. Oh well, no use crying over total humiliation. Adieu. <laughs> but Fluffy can't wear this. I'm ruined. It's okay. We'll save the dress. Lime is right. There's always a solution. We can fix this. You should stick to baking. Oh, that's more garden party than confection. Pass! Mm, it's a choice, but not a good one. It doesn't say fluffy chiffon. That says fluffy chevalier! <laughs> My cranberry jam always says failure is the first ingredient in the recipe for success. Well, if cranberry jam has a recipe for a stunning runway gown that transcends fashion, send it my way. Tell me you have an amazing idea. I have an amazing idea! <laughs> wow. You did say I should stick to baking. Hello. Banafi! <laughs> uh, before uh, you say anything, I know it's not what we discussed, but... Uh, Stop talking, because I love it! How did you come up with something so delicious? <laughs> Hi. Hi, man! Hi, man! Hi, man. Hi, man. Hi, man. Who are you wearing? Well, no designer is as talented as me, so I... Is that Banafi? What is she wearing? <laughs> Banafi, tell us why you chose this delicious dress. As a transberry, I love living out loud as my most authentic self. And I wanted to dress as bold and unique as I am, which, let's face it, is a tall order. With Fluffy Chiffon's help, I found two brand new designers who blew me away. This is a Shortcake Chiffon original. Strawberry, lime, what was your inspiration? Well, uh... I guess you could say defying confection. <laughs> hey, hey, Orange, ready to. What? Is everything okay? I can't believe what just happened in the terrific tales of Tangerine Smash. It's so epic. <laughs> What's so funny? It's cute how into it you get. I mean, it's just a comic book. Just a comic book? Tangerine Smash and her sidekick Lava Girl have inspired me my whole life. I mean, they're colorful. I guess I just don't get it. Being a superberry means you can make a difference. Make the world a better place. Well, our world is going to be a better place when we get through these to-do lists. Am I right? Uh, sure. What's more super than a to-do list? Another day, same stuff to do. It's okay, just push on through. Imagining how different life could be. If I could let my inner hero free. Picture me. A super berry, strong and brave and awesome, oh me. A super berry, watch my powers blossom. Take to the sky, up, up and away, dazzling the world as I save the day and be. A super berry, I'm on my way, I'll do what's right. I'll save the day, I'll win the fight. Imagine just how great my life would be. Up in the clouds, the world below. Hey, every berry, watch me go. I'll be the perfect hero, guaranteed. Picture me, a super berry, strong and brave and awesome. Oh, me, a super berry, watch my powers blossom. Take to the sky, up, up, and away. Dazzling the world as I save the day and be. Oh. 
around it, all you do, it's true. The real hero is there inside of you. All the greatness you can be makes you every bit a hero to me. Everywhere you go, everything you do makes you a hero too. So just be a super very strong and brave and awesome. Yeah, just be a super very let your talent blossom. Saving the day, reach for the sky. Get ready, well, cause I'm ready to fly. Shortcakes? What are you doing? I get it. I always say I want to bake the world a better place. Tangerine Smash and Guava Girl do the same thing, just with more punching and less pastries. So you like comics now? Well, my very bestie says comic books made her who she is. And she is pretty super. I've always wanted a sidekick. I'll be your Guava Girl anytime. <laughs> Thank you, Strawberry. It's my skydiving instructor's birthday today. Oh dear, my sitter is sick. How can I hit that drop zone with no one to watch Honeydew Sorbet? Sorry, Grammy Crumb Cake. I know you love skydiving. <laughs> now, Mary, sit. I can fill 50 cupcake orders in a day without breaking a sweat. Berry sitting a sweet little berry like honeydew. Total piece of cake. You're sure it's no trouble? Oh, not at all. I would be so happy to. Yeah, okay. I so appreciate your help. I'll be back in one hour. You big guy! Okay, honeydew. What do you want? Ha! Yep, that's not good. Hey, strawberry, do you have any? Oh, no. What happened? Honeydew sorbet happened. I'm berry sitting. I've read tons of books on berry sitting. Bringing a berry, happiest berry on the block, this is the perfect opportunity to put different methods to the test. You clearly need my help. Everything we need to know about berry sitting is in these books. Lime, 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 I'll be fine. She's just a little sprout. What could, oh yeah, she's gone. Huh? Oh. Oh. Yes, rambunctiousness. Speak softly to calm her down. Hi, honeydew. How about we put those... <laughs> it's not working. Here, bargain. Offer her something more fun to do. How about we sit quietly and read? No reading! Huh? It's snowing! Don't get mad. Empathize with her. Honeydew, I like to have fun too, but I need that free. What does Mrs. Crumbcake feed that kid? We should support her independence. If we support her too much, she'll destroy the berry works. Come on! Such a handful. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Same time next week. Huh? Oh. Desolate, but with my purple pie storage facility. Huh? Uh? Oh. Part of Anne Praline's job as the mayor's chief of staff is approving proposals for new projects. Even oh. peculiar purple proposals. I'm doing the city a favor, turning that unsightly eyesore into something useful. That eyesore is my lean green garden. The pie man has no right to demolish it. Who's with me? Demolishing a garden? Oh, no, Barry's gonna miss that pile of weeds. I just need the mayor's spunky assistant to give me her approval. I'm the mayor's chief of staff, actually, and I'll need the weekend. I think we're on the same page. <laughs> oh, what an awful man. Stop, stop, my man! Oh, no, oh, hi, oh, yeah. oh, man. Hello there, strawberry shortcake. Granola crunch. Uh, Lead gardener of the lean green garden. Well, only gardener. Till tomorrow, when the pie man rips it up. Unless... Stop, 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 stop. And Haley, stop, stop, is there something stop, granola can do to stop the pie man from destroying the garden? There is. If Granola can show her garden provides a service to the community, I can stop construction. But she just has the weekend. Up, oh, gotta go, good luck. Hey, Granola, wanna show us this garden of yours? Absolutely. You'll take one look at my garden and run as fast as we can in the other direction. Every berry ready to get this garden into shape? Yeah! <laughs> Leaves and grass get composted. I'll do it. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Energy efficient equipment only. You know what? I've got it. Drought resistant fruits only. Don't worry. I think I see the problem here. Granola, granola. I can see how um, passionate you are about the garden. But if it's going to be a service to the community, you kind of need to let the community in. But I want everything to be done the right way. Well, everything I know about baking, Sunberry had to show me. You know your stuff. Maybe you can show berries instead of doing it all alone. Berry working together made this place amazing. Oh, I love the smell of tears and demolition in the morning. What is this? This is the all new Lean Green Community Garden. Get off my property! Actually, just got off the phone with the mayor. Seeing the community come together like this, mm, 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 it is clear the garden provides an indispensable service. I'm afraid you'll have to find another spot for your pie warehouse, was it? Pie? Mm, yes. I think we're on the same page, yeah? What was her name again? <laughs> what do I want? A corporate warehouse with my face on it to store frozen pies. When do I want it? No! <laughs> we don't need more juicers, Lemon. But these are stronger, Lime. Look. Uh, I can fix that. Ugh. Lemon and Lime are so different. Why did they ever decide to share a cart? They didn't always share a cart. Ooh, flashback time. Let's go way, way, way back. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> right before Strawberry got to the Berry Works. Wait, wait. This is right before I got here? Lemon and Lime had separate carts and partners. Lime worked at the all-time lime truck with lime tart. What do you think you are doing? Setting out limes? Ugh, limes should be placed largest at the bottom, smallest at the top, less ripe to the right, more ripe to the left. This is chaos! We have to close until it's fixed! Ugh! Aww. And Lemon worked at the lemonade parade with lemon tort. Great! 
Butterscotch! I did it! The Hovercraft 800! Not bad. But how does the floating help sell more lemonade? Who cares? When you make a hovercraft, you just do it with style! This thing is radical! Radical? Are you sure this is right before I got here? Yeah. Shh, this is the good part. One righteous lemonade, please. This is the all-time lime cart. One lemonade with a hint of lime. You might like our limeade, which we is... We cater to lime aficionados only. You can get your limeless libation elsewhere. Good day, sir. But lime... I said good day. Whoa, killer cart. One lemonade. How about a lemon upgrade? Whoa! What were you wearing? Barry, I looked good. Now, shh. Smooth move. That dude is so over your cart. Maybe tone it down? As if my genius is totally unappreciated here. I quit. <sighs> I can't work with no rules! This is chaos! I quit! Ugh. Whoa, heavy? Those berries need a better business plan. Oh, the universe just gave me a radical idea. I don't know. I don't like tons of rules. Actually, I'd be okay with a few less rules, but I want to sell drinks, not spray down customers. Same! I want to improve the truck, but it won't matter if no berry is there to buy anything. They joined forces and became the perfect team you know today. Why is everything an explosion? Wait for it. I didn't mean for it to explode. I just want to make the cart better. I know. And logically, a stronger juicer would be more efficient. Can you make it less explodey? Yes! You're the best, Lime. So are you, Lemon. I couldn't run our cart without you. Aww. What are you all doing? If you're lost, Lemon, look and you will find her. Time after time. Lemon to your Lime. Ugh. Why are you so weird? Gradually add granulated sugar and beat until stiff peaks form. Macarons! Notoriously difficult to make. But just look at these cookie cuties. How hard can they be, huh? Hard. Very hard. <laughs> yes. With my lucky spoon by my side, there's nothing I can't make! I did it? I did it! I mastered macarons! <laughs> Hello, friends. Taste my perfect creations. <gasps> oh. uh. <laughs> Why can't I get this right? Why am I so unlucky? I have a lucky spoon! Is my spoon cursed? It's not your spoon that makes you, you. That's not an answer! I see. You know how to break the curse? You must ask your spoon. I'm sorry, what now? Come with me. Ooh. You must visit your spiritual swirlyverse and talk to your spoon. Uh. Hold the spoon. Close your eyes. Listen to, to my, my voice. voice. Imagine a staircase. Oh. 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 Breathe deeply. <sighs> Walk down the stairs. At the bottom is a door. Wait, there's no... Oh, never mind, we're good. Open the door and find yourself in your spiritual swirlyverse. Wow. This is the best place. Hey, 
Hey there, strawberry shortcake. Uh, hey. Ask you a question. What's wrong? Why can't I make macarons? Are you cursed? Am I a horrible baker? Do I need to go and... Whoa! Slow down. How long does it take to mix cake batter? What? It depends. What kind of cake? What ingredients? Do you want it fluffy or dense? Every cake is different. Exactly. Seriously, that's it? That's all you need. So, how long does it take to mix cake batter? I don't know. It takes as long as it takes. What? That mix cake is a good one. Welcome back. It takes as long as it takes? It takes as long as it takes! <laughs> so, she did talk to her spoon? Ah. Uh. Strawberry, you didn't do it. Is the spoon still cursed? Oh, no, no, no. Turns out I am a lucky berry with a lucky spoon. So I'm a really good baker, but I'm still learning. Some recipes will be easy, some will be hard, but I'll figure them out. Like my spoon said, it's just gonna take as long as it takes. Ready? Let's try again. Making the universe sweeter one spoonful at a time. Okay. No, no, no! <laughs> It's horrible! It's over! It's... A broken guitar string. I can fix that in... You don't get it! Poachella auditions are today! Poachella? Big Apple City's biggest music festival! They're looking for up-and-coming talent. Winner gets to open for Sherry Bobbleberry and the Berry Fairies! But every year before my audition, something happens to mess up my groove! Lost little... Huh? anywhere important to be. Hmm. <sighs> if you look outside, you'll see we have definitely crashed. Okay. No, yeah, that is very bad. But we can fix the guitar string. And send positive vibes your way. And build a mecha guitar that sounds sweet, plus transforms into a robot that can sing pop, lock, and jam. Too much? Thanks, berries. The guitar isn't the problem. I think it's me. Poor Huck. I know he can do this. We just need to find a way to help him get his groove back. Okay, berries, operation fix Huck. Let's think of something. Huck, wait! Oh, oh, keep doing that! You don't need a guitar! You just need some backup! Oh, come on, I know you can do this. Feel it deep inside of you. I'll sing right beside you. Together I know. You can hear it, a sweet melody everywhere. The sounds all around us, it's a symphony in the air. Start it small, becomes a road. So just let the music
was everything you are going to slay at Poachella. What's your band's name again? We are the Extraordinary Berries, and we can't wait to play at Poachella together. Because seriously, I cannot do this without you. We just opened for Sherry Bobbleberry and the Berry Fairies at Poachella. When we meet the Berry Fairies before they go on, follow my lead, okay? Play it cool. We are performers now. We're garbage! You're all garbage! Sherry, we just think it would have been nice to have you at rehearsal. I don't need rehearsal, Peppermint. I'm too busy making you sound good. That's it. You don't rehearse. You're mean, and we do all the work. If that's how you feel, let's see how the Berry Fairies do without Sherry Bobbleberry. I quit! Oh, it's you. You opened for us, right? Yeah, that's us. You were off key. Ouch. We don't need her. Cherry Jam can sing. She writes the songs anyways. Oh, no, 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 no. What if I mess up? What if they don't like me? When you're scared, remember one thing is true. You make the world a better place by just being you. So much for playing it cool. Who are you again? Strawberry Shortcake. She's always like this, but she's usually right. I know you're nervous, but Raisin Cane and Peppermint Fizz believe in you. When I'm nervous, I think of my friends. With them by my side, I can do anything. She's right, Cherry. We're with you. Who's that? What's going on? It's hard to find your way or to know just what to say when you don't feel like a star scared to show the world who you are you want to sing out loud stand up proud and face the crowd but you worry they won't care will they even know you're there find your voice find your slumber party I've been to. So I made the sweet and salty snack mix, and I am so ready to... I do... What do you do at a slumber party? Book club. Things could get intense. Ah! Scary movie marathon! Mm. Oh, the theme of tonight is relaxation. Junk food! <laughs> I am all about tea parties. Trez chic! That's French like the fries. It's gonna be perfect. But Elizabeth Kanye wanted nothing to do with Mr. Parsley. What? Trying to watch a movie here. Oh. In through the nose. Out through the mouth. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the 
this is not what I was expecting. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Kind of feeling like we're not all on the same slumber party page here. Speaking of pages, if we could all turn to page 394. Speaking of party, how about a proper tea party? <laughs> Scary movie marathon. Relaxing spa getaway! <laughs> Sorry. Okay! I have an idea. What if we take turns? Each berry gets a set time for their activity, and when this timer goes off, we switch! That way, every berry gets their dream slumber party! <laughs> this chai needs to steep for just a bit longer, then we can... Never mind. Ah, fiddle faddle. <sighs> Just as you're finally relaxed, you need to. Ah! I said relaxed! Elizabeth Benye's hand brushed Mr. Parsley's, and she finally knew that. <gasps> what? What did she know? Ta da! <laughs> Slumber party would go. Damn it! My remote little. Did everything it? about this slumber party is a disaster. <laughs> Not everything. This snack mix shortcakes made is great. Oh, thanks, Orange. It's a mix actually of sweet and salty flavors. They're really different, but when you combine them, it's <gasps> holy donuts. That's it. I know how to save the slumber party. Mr. Parsley, how dare you? Well, the movie version is even better than the book. It's so good. I don't even mind that it's not scary. Here you go. Way to go, Shortcakes! Combining our different things into one big thing made the perfect slumber party. Like any great recipe, it's how the ingredients blend together that makes the magic happen. And this is the slumber party of my dreams! Shop. The pies you love in an all-new location. Our current wait time is one hour. For no wait, consider visiting the Extraordinary Berry. <sighs> Again, absolutely zero wait. <laughs> Shortcakes, we love all these leftover treats, but we're stuck. I don't get it. Why is everyone obsessed with the frozen purple pie they've had a hundred times? Is it me? Maybe I'm not the baker I think I am. Come on, Strawberry. A baker needs to believe in themselves. That's what Jay Quincy says in his journal. I didn't know you were reading his old journals. Yep, he was such a kook. He was so protective of his secret recipes, he booby-trapped them to keep them hidden. <laughs> if there were booby traps, I'd find them. Press passing baker after my treasure sublime. Pass my cupcake test or be trapped for all time. Jay Quincy? Three chances you'll have, so you must be clever. But if you fail, you'll be locked away forever. Strawberry! Ah! Oh, ah! What should we do? Me? How should I know? Everberry, quiet! Let's think about this. Jay Quincy was a business berry, right, Lime? <laughs> A smart business berry doesn't waste ingredients. He would make it simple. Put this bowl on the scale and pour flour until the bowl goes down. Easy. One, but you're not done. Hey, you said Jay Quincy was an inventor too, right, Lime? Well, I won't be out invented by some fancy pants in a top hat. This bad burial hot wire whatever is locking us in here. Two, still not through. Yeah, so we're doomed. Wait! More than anything, J. 
Jay Quincy was a baker, right, Line? That means it's up to Strawberry. I don't know if I'm the baker I thought I was. The universe gives us talent so we can use them. You're a baker. You're right. Jay Quincy said this was a cupcake test. So let's get baking. Wait, 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 wait. One last thing. Legends say the crystal cupcake was the key to Jay Quincy's recipes. <gasps> Look! <gasps> Jay Quincy's recipes. I think I found my solution to the purple pie man. Step on up to try Jay Quincy Cupcakes Classic Apple Grove Compote Cupcake! <laughs> hey, buddy! You in line? <laughs> And triple berry cakes? Yep. On it! Woo! We are baking it happen, Custer! <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, look! What fresh new scheme has the purple pie man baked up today to make my life more miserable? I deserve that. I've treated you horribly. Okay. I've come to apologize and say goodbye. You're leaving? I can't compete with your baking. You're just too. Good. Me being good doesn't mean you need to quit. All I've ever known is baking. All I've ever loved is pastries. Now, seeing you, I realize there's nothing I can contribute to the culinary cosmos. Oh, fiddle faddle. Wait, wait! I looked up to you once. So maybe we could uh, bake together? Yes! Why didn't I think of this sooner? Partners! Partners? Whoa! No, no, no. I did not... Purpleberry Industries! We can run it together. You help improve my baking, and I show you how to get everything you've ever wanted. Everything? What do you mean? You've worked so very hard. Now put your mind at ease. Focus on your future. Think of the possibilities. Together we're a solid bet. Well, we will be. Together we'll make sure you get everything you've ever wanted. Make your dreams come true. Oh, everything you've ever wanted. Make your cake and beat it too. Come now, let's begin it. With me, the sky's the limit. Everything you've ever wanted, a gift from me to you. Just sign right here. Oh, one tiny little detail. Your truck. You'll have to sign it over to me. The Extraordinary Berry? Technically, it's competition. But once it and you are a part of the Purple Pie family, we're good to go. I don't know. Listen, you want a baking tip? Always use a whisk. But if you want to get ahead, then you'll have to take a risk. We'll make sweets the world will buy. Delicious. We'll take every piece of the pie. Everything you've ever wanted, make your dreams come true. Oh, everything you've ever wanted, make your cake and eat it too. Come now, let's begin it. With me, the sky's the limit. Everything you've ever wanted, a gift from me to you. Picture it and it's all yours. Cooking books and baking tours. Everything that you could want, your own cafe. Cafe? A restaurant. My own restaurant? Everything you've ever wanted, make your dreams come true. Everything you've ever wanted, make your cake and eat it too. Come now, let's begin it. With me, the sky's the limit. Everything you've ever wanted, a gift from me. See you tomorrow, partner. <sighs> There's a stain on your sleeve. 
did not see that. <laughs> Your contract clearly states that you must be presentable as defined by the CEO of the company. You are in breach of contract and therefore terminated. Oh! Oh, and your truck still belongs to me, which means you no longer have a vehicle, which means you can no longer work at the Berry Works. Have a nice day! Can't believe I fell for that. <laughs> Opening night of Tangerine Smash Sweet Justice. Me, my Berry Besties, and my fave Super Berry on the big screen? Does it get any better? Orange is way excited. I hope it all lives up to her expectations. This is the best night of my life! Woohoo! Huck, what are you doing? Strategizing. Do I go hot dog pretzel popcorn candy or candy pretzel hot dog popcorn? I know where I'm starting. A crispy, cheesy... <laughs> so, Tangerine Drizzle wears glasses, and when she becomes Tangerine Smash, she just wears that little mask and nobody recognizes her? Her vibe is totally different. Tangerine Drizzle is a clumsy, mild-mannered recorder. Tangerine Smash is... Worst Superberry ever. Huh? That's right, Clafu team. Pineapple Clafuti streaming live from Tangerine Smash. Sweet justice. Expectations? More zero than hero. Cheesy story. Cheap effects. And worst of all, a girl as a hero. <laughs> uh, if he doesn't like Tangerine Smash, why is he even here? Um... Where's Blueberry? What's so weird about a ketchup and jalapeno swirl cone? <sighs> I guess tonight the universe wants me to embrace the simplicity of vanilla. Blueberry! Blueberry? These cosmic citrus rays that gave her powers are not scientifically accurate. <sighs> Popcorn and candy! Hmm, pop candy? <gasps> or crunchy corn? Yeah. Tangerine Smash? <laughs> more like Tangerine Crash. Hit subscribe for more Clefu content. <laughs> uh. No Blueberry. Where could she be? Tamarillo, this journey has brought me to the right end. Apricot, my heart is the rind. <laughs> Having fun? Tonight was supposed to be perfect! Tangerine Smash with my friends! But everything is going wrong! Things always go wrong for Super Berries. Bad guys, disasters. What would Tangerine Smash do right now? Rhyme, just enjoy the movie. I'll explain everything later. Huck, obviously pop candy sounds better. Eat quieter. And Lemon, put the tools away! What is that? A toxic boxer 2000. Next time dude kicks my seat, he goes flying. Oh, yeah. Ah. <laughs> You're just being rude, so please put your phone away. And girls make awesome heroes. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> now that is one super berry. Holy donut, that was awesome! Told ya! Way better than I expected. Huh? When Tamarillo left Apricot for the Infinite Blender, then found out Apricot was his long-lost math tutor. <gasps> so deep. Yeah, I think you were in the wrong theater. Oh. Uh, anybody want to see Tangerine Smash again? <laughs> yeah. 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 Aww, my pop candy. Sorry. Life in the big city. Time for another perfect day. Here we go with the flow. Come on, no time to rest. What can I say? I'm on my way to be the very best. This is who I set out to be here. I finally feel like I can be me here. Always something new to whisk me off my feet. Everything is golden. Life is pretty sweet. I'm on my way. Hey! What more to say? Hey! Life is better than a fresh souffle. It's a very perfect kind of day. Good morning, 
shortcake. Catch! It's a very perfect kind of day. Growing up, I always knew there was more out there for me to do. More adventure far away, where I'd succeed somehow, some way. Now here with you, I finally see. It's all better than I dreamed that it could be. It's a very City went viral, but please, please don't call us famous. <laughs> We're just regular. He means me. The peculiar purple pie man. Okay, keep it together, Strawberry. He's just one of the biggest bakers in the city and one of your personal idols. <laughs> no big deal. Don't freak out. <laughs> Hi, Strawberry Shortcake. I have such a huge. <laughs> uh, no autographs. Too busy with this. Where did that come from? I give you the crown jewel of my empire, my flagship purple pie shop! Wait, you working here <gasps> with me? That's fantastic! See, my name is Strawberry Shortcake, and no I... No time for fanberries. I'm not a fanberry. I'm a baker, like you. Maybe you saw this video where I... <laughs> you are nothing like me. Snortflake, was it? It takes more than some silly video to make some berry a baker. Pudding boy! Let's inspect my shop. It's shortcake, actually. <gasps> what a perfect day, am I right? Met my baking hero. Sure, he doesn't know my name or think I'm a baker. Cool, 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 cool. But this is totally great! <laughs> Who doesn't love a brand new friendship challenge? <laughs> Do either of you have any sour sauce? Ew, that weird prickly fruit? It may look prickly, but it's gonna taste delicious in the soursop sponge cake I want to bake. It's out of season. You're not gonna find it anywhere in the city. Huck, what are you doing? I saw some prickly fruits while doing a gig in... Fruit Lake Alley. Fruit Lake Alley? What's Fruit Lake Alley? It's a secret market that sells impossible to find ingredients, including out of season fruit. Run by the sneakiest berries around. They'll sell you a pie and then steal the filling. Bad news. Shortcakes hasn't lived in Big Apple City as long as we have. She thinks every berry is as nice as she is. Fruit like Alley sounds adorable! We're, We're going, going with, with her. her. Hey, Caramella. Uh, why you gotta use my name up? Sorry, Caramella. This is Strawberry Shortcake, Orange Blossom, and Raspberry Tart. This is Caramella Eclair. Her dad runs... <laughs> what do you want? And can you pay? I woke up this morning and I said to myself, so let's make a sponge cake, but what kind? So I looked at my rest of <laughs> up, and yeah. She's nice. Hey, what do you want? What do you want? What do you want? I got a thing. You want a thing? I got a thing. Hey, kid. Want to buy an egg beater? Oh, thanks. But I've already got this. <laughs> These berries will swindle us any way they can. I'm sure that's not true. They seem nice. That guy's selling melons. Hollow melons. Well, that cake looks delicious. It's frosted with toothpaste. Oh, I'm starting to think these berries might not be trustworthy. <sighs> the crumb father of Fruit Leg Alley. Also, my dad, Caramel Tartufo. Mm, my sweet Caramella tells me you're looking for a sour soap. Very difficult to obtain. Luckily, I have a batch that just came in from Banana Beach for a price. Well, 
But my friend won't pay a nickel over market value. We didn't come here to get cheated. Before we continue and I respond to your disrespect, give me a moment to sample this banana bread made from my mama's delicious recipe. <coughs> This is not my mama's fluffy banana bread! Until the baker gets it right, Fruit Lake Alley is closed! Everybody out! Hmm? Over makes better. I can fix that. Why would you do this for me? Just trying to bake the world a better place one treat at a time. Huh? You've done me a kindness today, Strawberry Shortcake. This is what my mama used to make. The sour sop is yours. You're all welcome in Fruit Lake Alley anytime as my special guests. There you go. See, fairies always do the right thing if you just... Hey! Where's my sock? Go, Dad, yes! Put it back! We definitely would have cheated her if she hadn't won my dad over. Yo, keep an eye on your friend. She's way too trusting. No! Uh. <laughs> the Berry Works is going all out for our Frightful Fright Festival. Every berry is feeling the spooky spirit. <laughs> well, almost every berry. Everything okay? Ah! Oh, sorry. Um, I know we want to make our Fright Festival super spooky, but my Barioki card and I aren't going to be much help. I think Frightfall is kind of scary. Oh, huck you, sweet, sweet summer berry. Frightfall doesn't have to be scary. What's important is that every berry has fun and buys lots of arts. Terrifying tasty treats! Uh -huh. Sorry. Just focus on the fun instead of the frights. That's what matters. <gasps> Here comes every berry. Happy Bright Ball! Where are they going? Survive the graveyard of losers below and come get your Fright Fall Fright Exclusives! Purple pumpkin pies, purple pumpkin muffins, purple pumpkin smoothies, purple, the official color of Fright Fall! Graveyard of losers? Fine! We'll show every berry we're having way more fun down here! <laughs> Oh, how? Fun instead of frights. That's it. Anybody know what he's talking about? Yeah, here we go. Oh, listen, every berry, it's a scary time of year. But don't freak out, cause you've got nothing to fear. Tricking out. We're throwing a party and it's gonna be sweet. Oh, 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 right, it's a scary okey night.
get into the spirit. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. That's finished. Raspberry and I join forces for a special hair a berry pie. We have so many orders, we can't leave to deliver them. Luckily, I uh, know a berry. Who has two thumbs and a berry wagon that makes deliveries? This berry, right here. <laughs> no way. What? Puck is very reliable. <laughs> <laughs> this order goes to Fruit Leg Alley. Nothing can go wrong with Caramel Tartufo's pies. Luckily, I know a berry. No, I'm too busy. And also, no! Please, Fred, I need some very smart, punctual, and fabulously responsible to keep an eye on. Come on, Wheel. I know she's just flattering me to get what she wants, but it doesn't mean it's not true. Fine, I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> we need to follow my plan exactly to get these pies delivered on time. No questions, no conversation, no huck. <gasps> No unscheduled stops! Mr. Mangosteen was just telling me foxberries are in season! We don't have time for foxberries. Okay, let's get... Huckleberry, where are the pies? Give us back our pies! Please! So, how's it going? Completely under control. Really? We'll call you back! Fred, that was almost a disaster! Okay, if we take Cinnamon Street... <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> and then I said, cheese, mister, you gouda fooled me. <laughs> oh, thanks, Hawk. So funny and helpful. Here, I bought extra nutmeg. My way of saying thank you. Huckleberry! Look, Brad, Mrs. Crumbcake just gave us thank you, Nutmeg. Oh, does she have any focus on your job, Ginger, to go with it? Uh, I don't think that's a real spice. Come on. <laughs> Am I being punished? I feel like I'm being punished. <sighs> it's okay. I'm sure Mr. Tartufo will understand. I don't understand. To say I've been waiting all day would be an understatement. Sir? We could give you excuses, but life's real adventure is the journey. So we made sure these pies went on an adventure so big that you would taste our journey in each bite. I accept your nonsensical answer. I will consider our business concluded. Okay, let's get going. Uh, Mr. Tartufo, do I smell bilberries? Good nose. These bilberries recently fell off the back of a chunk. Please, take some on your way out. Awesome! What took you two so long? I'm sorry, I tried, but he just kept being him. Why is he your delivery, Barry? What ingredients did we need for tomorrow's pies again? Nutmeg, bilberries, and foxberries. What's that have to do with any? That is why. Thanks, Huck. Don't thank me. Thank my berry bestie, Brad. If it wasn't for him, who knows where I would have ended up. Ow! Don't worry, buddy. I'll teach you to be a delivery berry just like me. Great! So you two can be our delivery berries again tomorrow, right? No! Yes. It means yes. Good folks alive! I was literally gone five minutes. I mean, it all started out simply enough. Are you sure about this orange? Totally! My dad uses this momentum mixer every berry bounty banquet for his chunky gravy. It should work out great for your strawberry foam. Mm, I need a big batch for Honeydew Sorbet's birthday. Oh, I have to pick up some strawberries. But I will be back in five minutes. Leave it to me. You get perfect foam, I get a great workout. Just tap me on the shoulder when you get back. I'll be in the zone. Uh... You missed the trash can. Oh, did I? <sighs> Don't worry. I've got it. Gee whiz. Thanks, neighbor. <sighs> <laughs> Sour grapes, can I interest you in my new pop and papaya cone? 
papaya ice cream and a whole lot of firework flakes. My treat. Free? Why? The universe told me you should have it. <laughs> huh. I give you the embiggening ring. Imagine how many drinks we'll get from one biggened fruit. Are you sure it won't, uh... <sighs> Only one way to find out. Whoa! Can I try one? Sure. Just don't switch it to shrink. That's still in beta testing. <gasps> Let me go grab my tools. Mm. Where did you get that cone? Blueberry gave it to me for free. Niece, how many times must I tell you? We don't support local businesses, even if it's free. And beginning in five, four, three, Purple Pie Man. Oh, please. I had nothing to do with this. Huh, the shrink feature works. Score! I demand to be returned to my normal Pie Man stature! Well, okay. But we should probably clean up first, though, right? <laughs> oh, how dare you! You'll never get away with this! Once I'm no longer sprinkle sized, there will be a reckoning! Wow! Oh no! This is horrible! Hey, Lemon, do you have any extra huh. of those? Oh. Ooh. Mm okay, what is happening? <gasps> Lemon! Fusion Mary wants to interview you about your inventions! That's awesome! Also, what's Fusion Berry? It's the technology and innovation website. Every tech head in the city reads it. And that makes you nervous? They want me to talk about one of my inventions. You love talking about how everything should be bigger, stronger, more powerful. To my friends, not to some science stranger. Morning. <gasps> you should do it. Me? I don't know anything about your inventions. But you're so good at talking and words and stuff. Come on. Hey, Barry, good rotation on Earth access to you. I plump pudding for a fusion berry. You must be the incomparable lemon meringue. <laughs> I'm not lemon. This is lemon. Pleasure to meet your intellect. Oh, uh, of course. Formalities are an unnecessary precursor. Please, show me your best innovation. No. I know, right, Lemon? Who can pick from so many great inventions? I mean, there's the Dream Clean 3000, which exploded. Oh, the Sparkberry Turbo Cooler. Oh, yeah. Um, the Cake Nader? So many Cake Naders. Great inventors are always trying and failing. That's inventing. What's your neural noggin working on now? Oh. Oh, that's a lemon. What are you doing with my cat? I call it the Kitty Cannon! Oh, marvelous. Such precision. Such... <laughs> Fascinating. Uh, might you have any inventions that perhaps are less of the exploding variety? Uh... <gasps> yes! She does! Ta-da! My very, very oven! Oh, it 
it's an oven. Not just any oven. It's got a, um, well, it's actually, it's hooked up to the, well, it's pink. Oh. Strawberry is a really good baker and has to serve lots of customers. This is custom made bigger for maximum bakage and extra racks inside and it's hooked up to the truck's Sparkberry energy intake so it's extra powerful, just the way Strawberry likes it. Just to be clear, not all my inventions are pink. I knew she had it in her. Perhaps a demonstration of baking might be in order? Fresh from my one of a kind, lemon meringue made oven. I call it a galaxy cake. That was galactically good. Lemon, thank you for an illuminating afternoon. I'll post the article tomorrow morning. <laughs> Ta-ta for now. Not bad for somebody who doesn't like talking about herself. I'm glad Strawberry was there to speak up for me. But I'm also glad she has no idea how to talk about tech stuff. Help me figure out how I like to express myself. Outstanding oven helps Strawberry Shortcake bake it big in the city. Lemon, I am so sorry. I shouldn't have talked so much. That article is fantastic. It's all about my oven, not me. And the oven looks amazing. It sure does. Maybe more of your inventions should be pink. Don't push it, Shortcake. It's Bite of the City. The Peculiar Purple Pie Man has a special holiday announcement. Indeed, Kiki. Buy one of my frozen purple pies, and if you find one of these five tokens baked inside, you've won a month's supply of my new frosted mini pies! <laughs> Aw, the Purple Pie Man's feeling the winter swirl spirit. We should buy a pie. I won't buy it because I don't buy it. He's cheating. I know it. How? The tokens are in the pies. You aren't putting the tokens in the pies? Of course not. Why should I give away a month's supply of mini pies? Because that's what you said on TV. Niece, we let the customers think they can win, so they'll buy more pies. It's a victimless crime. Every berry wins, except the customers. So what about the tokens? Lock them in the register after the shop closes. And don't forget the alarm. I don't need some dishonest berry stealing a token to come Collect pies I have no intention of baking. Wow. We need to get those tokens and get them into some pies. But we can't do it alone. We need to put together a crew. We need a berry who knows her way around the berry works. The compass. So, uh, is there a way into the purple pie shop? That isn't the front door. Yep, there's an air shaft leading right to it. We'll need a berry who knows tech. The brain build anything strong enough to suspend a berry in the air? Automatic licorice dispenser. yippee pie Berries. We need a berry that's light, fast, graceful. The feather. You, uh, mind being upside down? Does this answer your question? And a berry to watch our backs. The eyes! I can see the past, the present, and the future. Just waiting for Sour to leave, then Orange can snag the tokens. Over. Huh. is gone, but there's some scary purple lasers on the floor. Careful, Orange. I've got this! Bingo! Well, that was easy. I can't believe it worked! It almost didn't. Good thing Sour Grapes left the tokens out for Orange. Huh? Let's give Kiki Key Lime a call. Jingle bells, snort cake smells. I can't believe Sunberry found all five of your tokens. What? That can't be. Oh, yeah, it can. No, 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 there's been a mistake. I got the tokens. Give me my pies. They're still my pies, and I won't give them away if I don't want to. <clears throat> oh, you, sir, I didn't help, Mommy. <laughs> 
Claire's dad runs some shady business in Fruit Leg Alley. Not the kind of berry you want to mess with. That's why we gave her the tokens. Mission accomplished, berries. We're a pretty good crew. My tinsel team. The strawberry six. Or maybe the shortcake seven. It's bite of the city. <laughs> <laughs> huh? oh! We're throwing a little soiree in the clubhouse so we can all watch Kiki Key Lime Super Sweet New Year's Eve special. We're just hours from the countdown and a live performance from Sherry Bobbleberry and the Berry Fairy. I love the Berry Fairy. My argument's a legendary contrary berry. I can't wait until midnight when the gumball drops in time spare. Or right here, it's a mecha mini gumball dropper. Sink to the big one in time spare. Lemon, that's great! But there's only one place I want to be tonight, and that's right here with my fairy besties. Strawberry, we have to go now! Raspberry, what are you talking about? Check your phone! Kiki Key Lime invited the two of us to hang out! <laughs> <laughs> but we made these plans, and... Do not even worry about it. The universe and Kiki want you there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> This is all very sweet, but we have to go! Best New Year's Eve ever! Kiki will be here shortly. Help yourself to craft services. <laughs> Look at us, backstage craft services, waiting for Kiki Key Lime. We have arrived! This is our destiny! <laughs> <laughs> huh. Our destiny is kind of cold. Well, I'm sure K -K -K Kiki just needs to recover from those bright lights on stage. Besides, it's not that cold. <laughs> okay, maybe it's a little cold. There they are. Strawberry shortcake, raspberry tart. I'm so glad you can make it. We are going to have so much fun. Tell me absolutely everything you've been up to. Well... We were so excited to come here because we knew that you Sherry Bobbleberry is gonna be late. She can't be late. We can't postpone midnight. <sighs> Sorry, girls. Need to handle this tiny thing. Then it's all us. You're gonna love it up on that stage. I'm sure she'll be right back. Everything we've ever wanted. We're almost ready for you. In just a few minutes, you'll be standing next to Kiki and waving. Won't that be the best New Year's ever? Best New Year's ever. Right. Okay, maybe tonight's not perfect. It's cold and Cherry Bumbleberry was late. But the two of us are gonna get to stand on stage near Kiki Key Lime. Every berry will see us up there. What could possibly be better than this? Well... It's almost gumball drop time! There's Kiki! But where's Raspberry and Shortcakes? Shouldn't they be with her? Nah, they had better places to be. Huh? You're back? The universe did not prepare me for this. W what happened? Well, we told Kiki that we really appreciated her invite, but there was only one place we wanted to be tonight, and that's right here, with our very besties. Aww. Aww. Besides that gumball in Times Pear, not nearly as impressive as a Mecha Mini Gumball Dropper. Ten, Hurry up, it's time! Eight, seven! Okay, two, you're five, right. This four, is better. Three, <laughs> I know. Two, two one! one. <laughs> <laughs> Lemon! My secret is just the right amount of icing with a cute little swirl for the cherry to sit on. This is exactly the kind of specificity my game needs. Totally. I'm always up for new adventures, and helping out on a baking game sounds super fun. Oh, it will be. Until the cupcake comes to life and the bake good goes bad. Baking bad cupcake apocalypse. It's gonna be epic! I gotta go. Meeting some other berries at Starfruit Express later. Did that little berry say Starfruit Express? Why don't we all go too? Starfruit! <gasps> yes! Yes! What is Starfruit Express? <gasps> Only the coolest roller skating rink ever! You go ahead. I've got things to do that are things. Shortcakes? Spill it. Fine! I can't roller skate at all. Like total disaster. 
so go on without me, because nothing is getting me to put wheels on these feet. <laughs> uh, bad idea! Big mistake! Didn't you just tell Applebite you were always up for new adventures? I meant adventures without tiny wheels on my feet! <laughs> I'm sure you're not that bad. I tried to tell them! <laughs> Come on! The shortcakes I know never gives up. Well, this one does, so just go on without me. I'll just hold you back. I'm a lost cause. Hey, you're always helping any berry who needs it. Yeah, so? So, even the berry who's always helping others is allowed to get help once in a while. Life's not always easy. We're not gonna win them all. My baking hero and the genius behind those purple pie shops on every corner of the city moved into the berry works. That should be the best thing ever. <laughs> hey there! <laughs> hey, never mind. <laughs> Except he barely notices me. <sighs> Morning, berries! You okay, shortcakes? You haven't been yourself since the peculiar purple pie man moved in. Your energy is way off. I know, I'm sorry. I thought if I ever met one of my heroes, we'd become best fairies, you know? Share baking tips, gossip until the sun goes down. You won't even talk to me. You're putting too much importance on somebody else's opinion. Your emotional well-being shouldn't be dependent on somebody you hardly know. What? I don't like feelings. But I understand them. Lemon's right. You don't need every berry to like you. We like you because we know you. You're right, Huck. Uh, I am? If the pie man gets to know me, he'll like me. I'm totally likable. <laughs> I just have to prove it to him. <laughs> she almost got it. Read My Peculiar Purple Life by the Purple uh. Pie Man? Oh. Ahem. You and me, could it be a friendship recipe? You'll see, you'll see, you'll see. You'll see. Oh. <laughs> 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 
right there with you, sad souffle. What's wrong with Strawberry? She can't get over the fact the purple pie man doesn't like her. We're trying to come up with ways to cheer her up. Oh, pfft. she doesn't need cheering up. She needs sense smacked into her with a spatula. <gasps> I'll do it. Get it together. <laughs> Who cares what the pie man thinks? Well, what if he doesn't notice me because I'm not worth noticing? <sighs> Get over it already. You've been the most confident berry I have ever met since the day you got here. Nothing I tried could stop you. That's true. You didn't get all mopey when we first met, and I didn't like you. Yeah, but with you, my strawberry senses were tingling. I knew you'd come around. Well, I did. Why else would I be standing here acting all sweet and caring? <gasps> You're right! Obviously. I need to stop worrying what other berries think. Just be the berry I know I can be. Exactly! Because eventually, every berry will like me. Well, that's not exactly... Listen up! I don't need to prove anything to you. I'm Strawberry Shortcake. You're about to find out just how awesome I can be. Have this muffin! Or don't! Either way, I made it and it's delicious! <sighs> she almost got it right. Tell me about it. I never thought I'd see this, but it is nice to have the annoyingly happy Strawberry Shortcake back. Who's the best berry? I'm the best berry! Making it happen, baby. Ooh, ah. Wow, she really is a lot, isn't she? Oh. Want to rise above the rest? Do you have what it takes to be a peculiar purple protege? <gasps> I've been wanting to find a way to show the Purple Pie Man how fantastic I am. And now he's looking for a right-hand berry. What, what? <laughs> Wait, you all want to be the Purple Pie Man's protege? Duh! An opportunity like this could jumpstart my baking career. It would be very educational. I just want to watch every berry fight. What? We're not going to fight with each other over a job. Prepare to fight with each other over a job! One of you lucky berries will soon earn the rare privilege of shadowing yours truly, all expenses unpaid. Which is applause worthy. <laughs> Show me your very best. Winning is everything, losing is for losers. Now, let the competition begin! Balance your duties and keep me on your mind at all times. A smart berry is always a front runner. <laughs> Shoulder the load so I don't have to. I love a determined berry who's not afraid to show she's better than the rest. Oh. Jump through any hoops I tell you to! I like a berry who flows while her friends stumble. <laughs> Divide, conquer, stay number one. Now the final competition. I've lost my keys. They're in that pie! Yeah. Find them. On your mark, get set, tear it apart! The Berry Works is a place of friendship, community, and inclusion. But look at us! I don't know about you, but if this is how to succeed in baking, by being mean and competitive and covered in ugh, pie filling, then I don't want to be successful. I want to be happy with my friends. What an adorably sweet and naive statement from Snotberry Blortcake. But friends don't win you awards. Friends don't put a pie shop on every corner of Big Apple City. It's a berry squash berry world out there. So you can be sweet, or you can be the best. Your call. I'm sorry, but I don't believe that. 
I think I can be the best without fighting the people who care about me the most. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, barf. Fine. You can all be losers together. The winner of the competition is her. Sour grapes! She didn't even compete. No, but she did enjoy watching you all fight. Also, she's my niece. Yay. You know what? We don't need the purple pie man. Follow me! I've got congrats on not being the purple protege cookies forever!